Boom. Oh. Oh, I'm excited about this. Tracksuit, 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 tracksuit. Bless you. Sorry, what were you saying? <laughs> I'm worried like 50 years from now I'll be like signing pieces behind a desk. <laughs> 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 That's your vision of hell. Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> yes. You're at the Hilton by the airport yeah. in Burbank. Yeah. And then like Army will walk by. And, like, <laughs> yeah, Army, will be, or something. Army will no. Army won't walk by. He'll drive by in like a, in a Bentley or yeah, something exactly, like that. Exactly. Hey, kid, how are things <laughs> yeah, going? Exactly. So yeah. fingers crossed. That's uh, not yeah. No, that's reality. not going to happen to you. Don't worry about yeah, that at all. That, that is not in the yeah. cards. Would you rather fly or be invisible? Fly. Invisible. What is your most used emoji? I like the peace sign and the rock on sign. Uh, probably the middle finger. Do you have a secret party trick? Yes, I can consume massive amounts of alcohol. <laughs> um, that's pretty good. Would you rather have fingers as long as your arms or arms as long as your fingers? I love that. That's a great yeah. question. I, I like stuff like that. Um, fingers as long as my arms. That's weird. Yeah, yeah. Uh, um, I feel like I'd really be able to throw a hell of a curveball, you know? Or, or arms as long as your fingers, you said? Those would be really short <laughs> arms. Weird. You wouldn't be able to eat anything or pick anything up. Those are bad, bad, bad options. I don't know. Death. Call me by your name too. Yeah. Yeah. Call, call me by your mother's name. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm out. <laughs> hey, real quick, uh, there's a joke we want to do later, uh, and we don't want to give it away, but we just need to know from IFC, are we allowed to say cum peach? We know? Okay, what if we said that there was a, a certain type of stone fruit that is filled to the brim with ejaculate? Is that okay? Yeah! But then we just got really lucky in real life too, like we just hit it off as human beings and this is one of my best friends and role models today, which is something that somehow I like to say. Just, yeah, usually he reacts like a curmudgeon when I say that, but this time he reacted nicely. Um, so... Uh, <laughs> Life. Well, yeah. when anybody sees this, you are so sexy in this movie. You wow. really, you yeah. really, okay. you All are. Right. I mean, it's, uh, yeah. Uh, I like. Oh my God, it's gonna be a lot harder to look you in the face now. No, uh, I mean, at my feet like, the rest of the interview. girls are gonna go crazy, guys are gonna go crazy. I didn't realize he was so young though. So hot. Timothy, I'm waiting for him to get like a little bit older, you know, like. Yeah. You know, buttering them Taste up, right now and then <laughs> like a pig for slaughter. Yeah. And I'm gonna swing right in there as soon as he's like 30. Just tell him to wait. So so talented and hot. And you learned Italian for this. You yeah. learned piano. You learned guitar. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's got all kinds of skills. You oh, don't yeah. even know about. No, I mean, well, you, what you, the hell does that mean? Yeah. 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 It was amazing. And I walked out of there, and like a typical actor, I was just like. I fucking nailed that meeting. <laughs> <laughs> and then I didn't hear anything from Luca for six and a half years. <laughs> and then he called one day and he's like, I've got a new movie. And I was like, I'm in. <laughs> Almost. Almost. Uh, I mean, he had to talk me into it. But yes, I'm in. Hey, Nick. Yeah. Nick, you know who's like in love with Timothy Chalamet? Who? My wife. And it hurts my feelings. <laughs> I love your name, by the way, Timothy Chalamet. I want to hear RuPaul say, Chalamet, you stay. DuVernay, sashay away. <laughs> Timothy, uh, by the way, thanks for taking a break from the gas station to come over here to the awards. <laughs> now, okay, gasoline or petrol is a transparent petroleum-derived liquid that is used primarily as a fuel, and I'm just, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. It's, uh, <laughs> no, seriously, it's because they, they were making fun of me earlier, so anyway. But um, look. Uh, <laughs> I had a director of a movie once ask me, do you want to do a shirtless scene? I said, what? He said, yeah, do you want to take your shirt off in the movie? I said, where? <coughs> he said, I don't know, any, anywhere you want. Do you want to take your shirt off? I thought, but it doesn't help tell the story of the movie. So, oh, you know, I just thought maybe if you want to take your shirt off. And I was like, no. Do a lot of actors ask you if they can take their shirt off? Because that's fucking weird. Unfortunately, Army Hammer can't be here today, which is probably better because we'd all be staring at him since he's such a goddamn hunk. Uh, I will say this though, Army Hammer is so handsome, he makes John Hamm like his name should be Tony Baloney. <laughs> 
Call me by your name, more like fuck me by act two. Bam. Just fuck already, guys. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. All I know is I went to Italy thinking like, oh, I've got like a cursory level of Italian. Like this is this is gonna be fine. I, I got this. And we ended up going to a restaurant and I tried to order a steak in Italian, and I uh, messed it up terribly because they brought me a raw steak. And I don't mean like raw, like you know, oh, we cook it a little in a little bit. It's raw in the middle. They brought me a steak that had never seen a heat source. No. Like no. literally, like just like straight cut from like the whole muscle, like a piece of steak. And I was so ashamed that I wouldn't own up to it, so I just sat there and ate an entire <laughs> Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Is there something that you find annoying from each other? <laughs> no, I'm the I'm the look, I'm the younger counterpart in the relationship. I'm the one that's annoying him. No. Uh, you know. Huh. Um, how do I annoy Army? I don't know, showing up at his house in LA unannounced. <laughs> uh, showing up to his kid's birthday party four hours after it starts. <laughs> uh, you know, things like that. That was just when the actual party was kicking off, though. It's so, true. Yeah, it's yeah, true. you're good. You're and good. I and I came in at a good time too because yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so do you, do you don't annoy him? I'm sure I do in some way. I'm sure in some ways he's like, dude, shut the fuck. Nah, up. absolutely not. Absolutely not. He knows dude. me by wearing awesome tracksuits all the time. Tracksuit game strong. Tracksuit, 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 tracksuit. Well, call me by your name, Rapid Fire. <laughs> I have a list of things. Paul. No, no, sorry. I haven't started sorry, yet, Army. Sorry. Um, and you both have to say at the same time, first thought that pops into your head. Oh, okay. Are you ready to accept this challenge? Yes. yes. Peaches. Cream. Luca? God, what the fuck? <laughs> Love. Um, Hate. Army. Army. Timmy. Elizabeth. Timothy. Elizabeth. Um... Um, I don't know, man. Me? <laughs> Italy. Luca. Grandma. Sex. Love. Pass. Music. Loud. Cuddy. Call me by your name. Awesome. And I'll call you by mine. Go to dance move, and you have to do it. I can't. I'm tight. I'm strapped in with a microphone. Uh, go to dance move. Just the bounce. Just bounce. <laughs> the dab. He busted out the dab. There you go. Um, so, you know, I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Um, Shouts out. Sorry. 2016. Sorry. No, no one will see it. Uh, people are talking about <laughs> your dance moves in the know. movie. Shit. Viral. <laughs> we would spend we would spend about 10 minutes every day in the morning just making out, <laughs> just kissing, just to get get all that stuff out of the way and really break the ice. Is there going to be a director's cut where your balls are not uh, digitally removed? <laughs> I hope not. Uh, <laughs> nobody really likes looking at a male ball sack. Like, I don't think any woman has ever gone, you know what's sexy? Testicles. So... What? Uh, I mean... <clears throat> yeah. What? I'm not even sure that other dudes, I mean, dudes who enjoy dudes, I'm not even sure if they enjoy ball sacks. Did you check the, the, those scenes out? No, I mean, the scenes are in there, uh, but they took my balls out. Um, people are talking about your dance moves in the movie. Mm -hmm. Is it true that you're going to go on tour with Beyonce? She, she keeps asking. Oh, she really? keeps no. asking me to go on tour. I'm always like, look, hey, <laughs> you know I love you, but I just can't. So, you call I don't think it's going to work. Bay, you're on that kind of level with yeah, her? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, do you want to tell us a little bit about how you uh, got ready for the peach scene? <laughs> And learned, I've seen a lot of peach emoji coming out. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm milking it for all it's worth. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, what? Well, you know, I've been looking for a project for uh, a really long time where I could have sex with a fruit. Mm -hmm. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, they didn't cast you in Girls Trip? No, no. And I was too young for American Pie when that uh, yeah, came out. Uh, I was like three or four. But, uh, I have to comment on the dancing, because that was one of my favorite bits, just seeing yeah. the dancing. <laughs> because for me, the most awkward thing that I think I could ever do on camera is dance. Me too. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say, was there music he playing was when so you were doing it? He was so miserable that I night. I hated that day. That's that's one of the hardest days I've ever had of filming, uh, because there's no music. So like, it'll start and it'll be like dun 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 dun, and then they'll turn off all the volume, and then I'm just like dancing, and then there's like 75 background artists all just like watching, who are bored, who've been there for hours watching the same thing, and then like the whole crew is watching, and I'm dancing to like nothing and silently. And in my head, I'm just screaming, I hate this. I hate this so much. And then I look over at Timmy, and he'd be off camera dancing, like having his own good time. And I was like, now I hate him. Like, I, ah. it was, That's a great irony as well, that it's you're portraying someone feeling very free, and you feel so uncomfortable. So uncomfortable. <laughs> I'm not surprised again. That was like probably my least favorite thing to 
to ever do would be dance. Try and being you... six foot five. <laughs> then you're and just he's like, like the kind awkward, of blended. lanky guy. I'm very sure. <laughs> bumping into people on the dance floor. And you're like, sorry. You know. How has the last 11 months kind of just changed your sense of what's possible? This is no, crazy. Yeah, it's been absolutely crazy. And uh, I'm pinching myself a lot, but I got an awesome older brother and a role model here in Army. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and uh, I have a feeling he's going to get you for that. Yeah. yeah. And, you know, it was, there, there was something a little strange because we premiered at Sundance. We went to Berlin right after, too, and it was a really great welcome. And then there was like a four or five month pause, you know, and oh, yeah. Army and Michael go on and live their, and Luca lives on their superstar director, actor lives. And I was like riding the subway, like, and yelled at by crazy people. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> but uh, no, it's been, it's super satisfying now that it's coming out and it feels like finally, yeah. you know, I'm excited for people to see it. It's John Travolta's got his own fucking private, like, jumbo jet. That's a question, would you get on that jet? Shit, yeah, it's probably really nice on the inside. I got to give a little speech and I shouted out Cardi B in my speech because I was like, well, it was a like Cardi B. Because naturally. It, naturally. It, was, well, would. it was a New York event and I felt, you know, I'm a New York guy and I felt like it was due diligence to thank any and all New York artists that inspired me. And the next day, somebody had messaged her that this kid had mentioned her in a speech and, you know, she acknowledged it. So there's an infinitesimal part of Cardi B's brain that knows I exist. Yeah, she, she fully slid into your DMs. No, not at all. Yeah. So, it was like the movie where I was... Everything else in the movie played out, too. <laughs> yeah. Thank God for that. Really going for it. Yeah. Uh, but we just got to spend so much time together, and we had that you know, kind of luxurious opportunity of really getting to know each other as people before we had to show up on the first day and start making out. <laughs> I was more uncomfortable during the dance scene, to be perfectly honest. Um, uh... Maybe a sex scene, but but not because it's a sex scene, but rather because I really enjoy dancing sequences and things of that nature. <laughs> <laughs> not uh, that he doesn't enjoy sex. Yeah, I did ask for like some lining on my short shorts, on on the on the bathing suit because there was no lining, and I was like, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be longer. It's just that it, like every pair of bathing suits ever, to my understanding, has had some sort of lining on the inside. I remember that. <laughs> Let's go for it. <laughs> so we start making out, and then we're making out, and we're making out, and we're making out. And we're making out, and it's going for a long time. And I remember we kind of stopped and we look, and Luca had just left. <laughs> so he just left us making out in the grass. And that was our only rehearsal for the film. Luca, is that what happened? <laughs> yeah. Sure. <laughs> well, you got the rehearsal out of the way, and you were good to go. <laughs> they were cute. But still, the, the, that thing about, you know, Torres and accepting, because some people still don't accept, you know, the films between pe uh, two people of the same Fuck gender. It, thank you. Th yeah, exactly, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the we, shorts were very short. I don't know, the shorts were very short. It's all that I would say, actually. I'm going to stop there. We can talk about that, right? Yes. Okay, because in fact, I can say this word. Yes, yes, we can say it in French. We can say it. 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 Fuck yeah, man. That's right, you can say it. So... We were kicked off American TV for that. On va se faire virer, hein. On se fait virer aux États-Unis. En fait, les shorts, ils étaient tellement courts que les testicules d'Army sortaient tout le temps. Alors, dans, dans le edit, il a fallu euh, les enlever. Au montage, ils ont effacé. Au, 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 au montage, ils ont effacé, mais je dois dire. Right, okay. <rire> ok, je crois qu'on peut s'arrêter là. Ils ont effacé numériquement. Voilà. Vous êtes tout rouge. Je dois dire que je ne m'attendais pas forcément à parler de mes couilles aujourd'hui. Bienvenue à la télé française. Oui, bienvenue en France, man. Bienvenue en France. Non, il n'y a aucun problème, ça me va. Alors, c'est un...